Hello guys and welcome to my YouTube show, Ruben's History Show. And today I'm going to talk about the the rise of the death and the death of Tiberius and the rise of Caligula, who became the emperor of Rome following uh following Tiberius's death on March on March 16th, March 16th, uh, 37 AD when he died at the age of 77. When Caligula uh, killed him while he was asleep, he suffocated him while he was in bed during that time. And while well, he he killed he killed uh, Tiberius because he wanted to become the new emperor of the Roman uh, emp of the Roman Empire. So Tiberius, so Caligula held that position as emperor of the Roman Empire from March sixteenth. 37 AD when he took when he killed uh when he killed Tiberius all the way to J July January 24th 41 AD when he was 28 years old so so uh, Caligula was born in an Antium Antum Antium in Italy in Italia which was then the Roman Empire but now it's present day present day the Roman Republic well, now it's present-day Italy, or the Republic of Italy, which is located in uh, Europe. It's located in Europe. So he was named in the honor of his of one of his famous uh, relatives, Julius Caesar. Caligula's name was Gaius Julius Caesar, so he was named in the honor of his relatives during that time when he was born. And his also his name also his name Caligula meant it was soldiers so little soldiers boots. That's what his uh, name means. That's what his uh, nickname. That's what his name means, Caligula. So he was born on August thirty first, twelve B twelve, August thirty first, twelve A.D. And he had. He was one of the six. He was one of the th three of the six children of Germanicus, who was Caligula's father. And he had about he had about two uh, two brothers. He had two brothers, two older brothers named Drusus and Nero, who were the two brothers of Caligula. And he had over three younger sisters, which were Agrippina the Elder. Julia Drusilla and Julia Levia. So those were his two sisters. And he was the nephew of Claudius, who would become the next emperor of Rome following the death of his nephew. Following the death of his nephew on January January the 24th, 41 AD, when he was killed by this protration pro, uh, uh, officers which was a uh, army in the uh, Rome during in the ancient Rome during that time. Yeah. So he his father was Germanicus during he was father was Germanicus who who he stayed in Egypt during that time. I think it was 19 AD when he was in Egypt and then what he caught a cold while he was in Egypt in ancient Egypt at the time and he had to stay and then he returned to Antolcha Syria or Roman Syria which was one of the provinces of Rome of ancient Rome during that time and then he died while he was in Syria during that time and on October 10th 19 AD 19 AD stands for after death or Anno Domini or the year of our Lord, which we live today. That's the time period where we live today. Now, we live in that time period, AD, and we will always live under that time. So, in, thir in 31 AD, in 31 AD, uh, um, a 31 AD, Caligula was invited to stay with uh, Tiberius on the island of uh, Crippa, which is an island in Italy, or it was the Roman Empire during that time, where he lived for six years with him. So he was uh, he was very good. He was uh, he was 
not he was a uh, actor during that period. He was an actor dur during that time, and he and in third and uh, while well, in thirty three thirty three A D, he was he gave Tiberius the emperor of Rome gave uh, Caligula the the position of of quaestor the quaestorship was which was an office to investigate crimes in the Rome in the provinces of Rome to investigate any crimes in the in the provinces during that time and he held that position until he became emperor in 37 AD when he killed uh, Tiberius and he got Tiberius got very old and he started getting sick because he was in his 70s and he was a very old man Tiberius when he was when he was uh, when he was on that island of Crepa during those uh, six years. So in thirty in thirty five A D Caligula was named was named the heir to Tiberius during that during his stay in the island of Crepa during that period, and well well on well during the dur during the time of Ti Tiberius who was the emperor of Rome following the death of Augustus. There were these uh, public trials that were held in Rome uh, for the people who were against, who were against the Roman, who were against the Roman emperor, not Hadrian, sorry, uh, Tiberius. So pe people were put on trial because they stood against the emperor for, for what he was doing during that time. And people were started actually being killed if they didn't, if they, if they didn't like uh, the T Tiberius, the Roman emperor, and he was kind of like an, a Stalin, an old paranoid Stalin who started uh, arresting a bunch of people and started putting them on trials and even killing them or sending them to exile. So that's what happened under the rule of Tiberius. Those trials were called the public trials during that time. So after, so on March 16th, 37 AD, while Tiberius was asleep, he was killed. He was killed by uh, Tiberius. He was killed by Tiberius because he wanted to become the new emperor of Rome. So he killed him while he was asleep and he suffocated him with a pillow. He suffocated the emperor while he was asleep during that time and he was and while while he was left the position of emperor and Tiberius's grandson Grimalus was also also served as the second emperor of Rome he was the joint emperor of Rome to, with uh together with Caligula and Tiberius Ti when Tiberius was suffocated or killed by uh by Caligula he was at the age of 77 when he died so that's what happened while he while while Ti when Tiberius died so yeah that's what happened that's what happened during his stay while he was on the island of Crepa and people of Rome the people of Rome received word that received word obtained obtained word that uh that Tiberius was killed and the new emperor will be Caligula so while well, Caligula was the emperor of Rome for just for over just 3 years from March March 16 37 AD all the way to January 21st 12 24 41 AD so that's basically just 3 years as the emperor of Rome during that time during that period while he was em while he was emperor he while he was emperor in October 37 AD he saw he was very ill and he was he was very ill during that time because he had this uh, something happened to his brain and he was seriously ill during that time and he was he was very ill during that period of time. And also another thing when tri when t when Caligula was the leader, 
when he was the no not the leader uh the emperor of rome he actually started killing christians the like the christians that believe in the christian the christianity religion he started killing them he started ki killing the the christians because he believed that they were causing problems for the rome for rome and that's why he started burning them alive and putting them in hot lava and all that terrible stuff it was it was horrible what he was doing while he was the emperor of rome and also i believed he really liked women yeah because i remember watching a documentary on the on caligula while it's called the emperor uh not the emperors of rome uh there was this uh sh there was this uh show i was watching on on netflix I think it was almost two months ago, I was watching a documentary on the Emperor Caligula, and it said that he was married to his sister, Ju Julia Drusilla. He was married to his sister during that time, while he was the Emperor of Rome. He was married to his sister, from, from, what, I, from what I remember during that time. He was married to his sister. So, yeah, he was kind of evil. Well, I th well I believe the the Christians just said that that type Caligula was kind of evil, and he and he killed many Christians, and that's why, pe uh, the Christian people started calling him ver started calling him evil during that time. While he was the emperor, while he was the emperor of Rome, he wanted to expand the Roman Empire all the way to Britain during that time and he by 40 by 40 AD at like 40 40 AD which was years after which was four years no which was three years after the death of 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 Tiberius who who died on March 16th March 16th uh, 37 AD during that time well, after the death of well, after the death of Tiber after the death of Caligula, under the new emperor, uh, Tiber no not Tiberius, uh, Claudius would under Claudius would expand to Britain. So Britain would become a Ro Roman province by forty three forty three A D under the under the rule of Claudius, the new, the emperor who would succeed. Um, Cla uh, Caligula, who was the Roman emperor during, after that time. Well, he, while, while he was in Rome, he was in Rome during that time, and on J January 24th, 41 AD, Caligula was killed by the Protation uh, Guards, Protration Guards, which was an uh, an elite army in the in the Roman Empire during that time, he was killed while he was while he after he was watching an Olympic game in the not Olympics the uh, watching a gladiatorial game in the city of Rome. This court the court officials the court officials of the Protration Guards started stabbing him to death. They started killing him during that period. And he and uh, well, the plot was planned by three men, by three. The plot was planned by three men, but it but many of them were in the Senate. So this so three men in the Senate were planning the assassination on Caligula, who was a Roman emperor during that time. During that time, he was killed. So well. Well, he well on that on that day his on that day his uncle his uncle took over, Claudi Claudius became the new Claudius became the new emperor of Rome following the death of his nephew Caligula in the city of Rome, and and the Platina and the Platina Hills in Rome and the Roman Republic. Claudi Caligula died at the age of twenty eight, so he would he was pro he was the youngest emperor to be appointed as the to be appointed as the emperor of rome so he was very young and his uncle would take over as the emperor of rome on Jan january january 24th 41 a.d 
and he act his uncle ruled for over 13 years claudius ruled the roman empire for 13 years from june january 24th 41 a.d all the way to what october 13th 54 a.d when he was ki when he was killed by his wife agrippina the younger Agri agrippina the younger and by the the mother of nero who had become the emperor after Cl after claudius and in that and then and i'm going to talk about that in my next video and i hope you enjoyed this video very much hopefully you learned something and i'll see you in the next video